I've seen a lot of. I know who Crack Amico is. I, I did D your video. D D Vito. I know who Ray DeVito is. Yeah, we're, fucking... we're big fans. He's not going to say anything. All the stars are here. Ray DeVito. <laughs> All the stars are here. I mean, and Ray was, DeVito. That was actually my favorite thing. Was Kevin somehow was like, uh, like everyone was talking about Tony. It was a huge thing I was talking about. It, and Kevin's tweet about it was like. He's reading the room like Ray DeVito. <laughs> I was like, God <laughs> bless Kevin's ability uh, to bring everything uh, back to Ray DeVito. <laughs> oh, <God>. Yeah. <laughs> uh, welcome to my life. Welcome. I wish do it you, upon uh, nobody. You, I wish it upon no one. Ray, do you like Kevin? What What is that relationship like? Yes, I don't know. It's an abusive relationship. But yes, I do like the guy. You abuse each other? No, it's pretty one. <laughs> it's pretty one sided. Uh, I I try to keep it light on the show. I'm like the nice guy. Yeah, yeah I'm getting you those seem vibes. you seem a little out of place, honestly, from the rest yeah. of the personalities. <laughs> like I guess sucking each other's wives off and doing blow and stuff, and in the middle of it all is Ray Devito. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I like seeing Robbie. Uh, I saw you a few weeks back at Grove Thirty Four, and Robbie's just like. Dude, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> he literally just wanted to give me a hug. Like, we, yeah, we really are. Going it on? it is like, kind oh. of bewildering to all of us because, Ray, you're not like not a like figure Kevin. of note. <laughs> well, it's because Dalton did Kevin's show and Dalton was like, I don't know what was going on. They were just talking about Ray DeVito the whole time. <laughs> Kevin, yeah, Kevin what? has like this weird... Something you've done is really stuck in his crawl because he keeps mentioning you. And uh, it's like, I would get it if you were like a fame, like some famous dickhead, but you're like, what do you, you, what do you, you feature? Do you feature? Do you even perform at clubs? Do you have any TV credits? He's, do, he's doing up and show me the W2s. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> show me the, show me the, the W2s. <laughs> Which, by the way, Unfortunately, I'm in most of the clubs I do, and no one knows who I am. So. That's like Kevin. That was that was a great Kevin Brennan era. Was when he was demanding Dave Smith show him his dead ninety nine. Which is hey, look, that's something not a lot of people talk about. Is that ten ninety nine? As a comedian, you are an independent contractor, and it's a ten ninety nine job. So it's gonna, you're going to get hit harder in taxes and health mm -hmm. insurance. Uh, yeah, my friend Malia Simon did your show too, and she seemed very caught off guard by your fans as well, Ray. So yeah, are they are <laughs> they fans? Are they fans? <laughs> that was what I, I don't know. It, this is I'm piecing it all together. They're throwing a birthday party uh, for me Sunday in uh, New Jersey. So oh god, this sounds like a good fellas situation. You're gonna get caught <laughs> in the gonna, eye by Chad <laughs> Zumok, dude. <laughs> I'm gonna get whacked on my own birthday party. And we're I'm gonna get the call and like start hanging up the, the fucking Zoom or the stream yard like De Niro in the phone booth. Uh, <laughs> I love everybody. I wish them well. I think that's what it is. It's like everyone else is like so like Ray I was one of us. Effort. And I tried when to Ray was, when Ray was having the birthday party, it was like we was all having a birthday party. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. I, I just want them all to get along. That's it. Which is like the worst thing for the Dabbleverse, because that's not what anyone wants to do, is get along. Yeah, it's funny the crossover that we get to sometimes, like, and they'll always, like, try to, like, rope us into it or whatever. But I'll have no, I just have no, con like, there's one Twitter person, like, really trying to set me up with Kate Quigley, who I guess is in, is in the mix or whatever. And it's like, what's going on? It's just so strange. No, uh, Malia is uh, great. I, um, yes, I, my yeah, apologies great. that she was taken off guard by anything. I she's think like, she thought it was. I think she thought it was funny. Malia has a really good sense of humor. Yeah. And I don't know if you're familiar with like the super chat format, but on this show, Ray Devito, we actually do a show besides the chat. <laughs> so that might be, it's not might be a little part. weird. For you. Yeah, yeah. It's uh, it's not how it works in my. Yeah, yeah we like, we try not to repeat any of them. We we try not to read the same uh, one two or three times. No, no. After Dal I was like, don't have Kevin show going. He's like, it seemed to be mostly reading super chats well, and asking. No, I'm not. I'm not talking about Kevin. I'm talking. That's the way my show is too. I interact with the super oh, okay. chat a lot. So, I mean, so, so no, that's my show as well. I was, I but when I, did I was Kevin's talking about show, Kevin. When I was when I did Kevin's show, most of the show was just him being like, All right, "Hold on, what does this say?" And then he was like trying to figure out, I, you know, he I, I he still for a guy who 
His show is mostly reading super chats out loud. He struggles to read out loud. <laughs> no, so he's wrong with it. I'm not. I'm not. I can't sit here and let you bash on Kevin because Lord knows <laughs> I'm gonna. I'm gonna get it anyways. But like, no, Ray. the guy's fucking funny as fuck. I think Kevin's Ray, I, fun. I think Kevin's funny. It was yeah, just he's like, funny as hell. It, it was surprising to me how much of the show was just him. He invited me on, and then him being like, "Shut up! I gotta read a super chat." What, <laughs> right, man. Well, to be honest with you, the community, like my birthday party, it's going to be like a bunch of people that like Super Chat. It's very interactive, you know, and here's the deal. 90% of them, 95% of them are great. You'll get some that just uh, are there just to like try to come at you. Hey, you know? is somebody giving hey, well, you money. Hey, doesn't so sound, I, I'm not familiar with that. <laughs> <laughs> We're not, we wouldn't be familiar with that kind of fan base. Uh, if somebody wants to give me money to say something mean to me, it's like, yeah. all right, whatever. Thank you for the money. <laughs> so, yeah. what is that behind you, Ray? Is that a treadmill? It's a treadmill, yeah. You be running on that thing? No, no, no one. Um, no, nobody runs on that. I, I, I kind of run out. Uh, what is I, it for I, exactly? It just has stuff on it. It is for people running on it, but nobody runs on it. <laughs> nobody runs. I stay here. I stay in New York City, and I stay here in Ohio when I'm not on the road. And uh, oh, you're in Ohio. Yeah, I rent a room here. Um, some family friends. Um, I rent a room from them monthly, and then my buddy in uh, New York, I'll crash at his place and like pay him money to crash there. So Ohio, that's where I'm at. So, you know, Ohio. Wow. Have you noticed Ray, that it seems a lot of just like crashing? Yeah, that's true. What's that? Have you have you like noticed a lot of sociopaths come from Ohio? Like I would say, like ninety percent of people born in Ohio are like the biggest sociopaths you've ever met in your life. Oh shoot! Maybe I'm a sociopath and I don't know it because we're all sociopaths. now. You're I can tell you're pure of heart. <clears throat> yeah, but you think about like uh, you might like this guy, but maybe it's the oh it's it's the Ohio thing. That's why you like Tony. I get it now. I see it. So well, I, I don't know enough to like him or hate him. Uh, like I said, the stuff. <laughs> oh, I've heard yes, you do. Him, yes, you. Funny. If you've seen him. Uh, <laughs> at all, you you know enough to like <laughs> most people. Most people got their first five seconds of exposure to Tony and know they hate him this week. <laughs> they see you him know. walk on stage and his get up and his face, and they go, "How could this get any worse?" And then he opens his mouth and goes, "Hello, uh, hello!" Like, oh my god! Yeah, he 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 did eleven minutes of stand up comedy at a Trump rally, and there's an entire United States province that is galvanized against him. <laughs> I, <laughs> that's really but funny when you think about from it o, from ohio we have tony hinchcliffe tom segura the paul brothers and i mean we could just think about those, those well, we also got drew carey you know, steph curry drew was born in lebron or yeah. and lebron was and also born Hosp- in steph curry's Hosp- north carolina no, he's born in ohio he was, though he's born in ohio born um, don't mean shit because del curry yeah, he is he is, ne- he is north carolina as hell where were you raised? That's yeah, where, that's he where really the friend, friend of the show been. Ian William is from Ohio of the band Holy Coast. Um, yeah, yeah. Crack did nice. name Crack did name a quite a murderer's row of murderers. I just think assassins. Think, assassins. Lord, hit the like button and be like, hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. okay, fuck you, Doom. Goodbye. I'll do it like that show. Goodbye. Shut up, Doom. Doom, cool it. For the love of God. Come on. Doom, you're gone again. That's it. I'm so sick of you anyway.